Ty just said he planning on starting you against OKC. Um, how good does it make you feel that you've kind of played your uh, I mean, way um, into kind of a spot, at least for now? I mean, it feels great, you know. Um, every day I'm getting uh, more confidence every day uh, being in the court. And um, now I'm just there trying to help. Uh, and um, uh, especially in the defense, yesterday was a big challenge for me guarding Kyrie. I mean, uh, he's a, I think, best point guard in the world right now. And uh, with those handles, I mean, it was really tough for me. And it was a great challenge. So tomorrow, if I start again, it's going to be a great challenge again against guarding uh, Paul George uh, or uh, Russell Westbrook. I mean, uh, Russ is um, just very good, a lot of energy. So it's going to be another big challenge for me. Did you? sort of figure Kyrie out during the game or was it just I mean could you pick up any tendencies you know what I mean like um I mean like first defense on him so he just made a three the first one I was like oh my god this is gonna be tough and um so in the second time I tried to be more closer to him okay. and uh to force him to go to the basket but then uh he drove a foul but um I mean, for the first time, I think it was uh, it was okay, and uh, I have to work my footwork better and uh, be ready uh, for the playoffs. How, how have your last couple of games been received back in Turkey? Do you have any sense of, of how, how they're experiencing your success? I get really good feedback. Um, <laughs> they've been texting me all the time, and um, they're they're following me, and I'm really thankful. It, it give me a lot. Uh, they give me a lot of support, and. Uh, it's a it's a big challenge for me, playing in the first five against those good teams, you know. And uh, they've been following me and supporting me, and that's given me a lot of motivation. Okay, how do you hear it on through Twitter or, or how you? Yeah, on the Twitter other. most of the time. So last two nights I was a uh, trend topic in Turkey. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> but no. No big deal. Yeah. I, <laughs> no. It, I mean, it is a big deal, no. but no. For me, seriously. Uh, I'm just having a lot of fun. Did you fun. check your number of Twitter notifications or anything? <laughs> so after the game, that was a lot of it. That was seriously a lot. And uh, but the only thing what I saw was uh, <laughs> that I get a mention from Shacknuffle, and they were saying me welcome to Shacknuffle, and uh, that was the only one that I was uh, care about, and I was laughing a lot about. But um, it's all good. Oh, Shaq in the pool? Yeah, oh, Shaq in the pool, yeah. And uh, I made it, so uh, it's all good, yeah. <laughs> How did you handle that? You obviously have good nature about it. LeBron last night said, hey, we're not even going to talk about that. Yeah. Um, do you recognize, with something like that, the amount of eyeballs that are on the, you know, anything you guys do with the Cavs? Um, did, did you recognize the amount of attention the Cavs get when a play like that gets? Uh, oh yeah, I mean, at <laughs> first I saw like, I don't know, seriously, I don't know what happened. Probably I get too excited. I don't know. Um, <laughs> but I saw everybody stand up, and when I missed it, I saw like Jeff was so happy, and then he was like, oh. Man. <laughs> you know? But um, it's all good. I mean, uh, of course, but the. I can tell this from the beginning uh, of the season when I come here that I'm working on my uh, mental preparation now and that was an important challenge for me. When I missed that dunk, um, I keep playing and then uh, coaches and my teammates keep supporting me and I just keep playing, you know. Uh, for me it was really important to keep playing and uh, that's what I did and as a mental preparation was really good for me. Yeah.